everyone this is mr director salabtarsek.com and today i have this uh, device so this is a uh, internal card reader that can be seen in some of the old type desktop computer so this one can uh, used only in a desktop because it is being connected into the motherboard to the use of this one so we can only see this so this uh, part of this internal card reader is put into the motherboard then automatically when you open your um, computer you have an instant card reader so by the way for you to use it you need to install the driver for this device and i came up in idea if i can use this as an external card reader for my laptop so i have my laptop then i just want to know if uh, i can use this as internal card reader because i know that it is much faster as compared to those uh, card reader that can be seen or that can be bought in the internet in the local electronic store so this one is a card reader i want to choose well, I want to use this one as compared to this one because uh, uh, it is much faster because it is I think it is a 3.0 using the 3.0 speed as compared to this one is only use a 2.0 so uh, I have a uh, one problem is how can I use this as an internal card reader so through that with the use of this one uh, I come up with the idea that uh, it uses the, the red the white the green and the black wire so i can ready here that i can use a uh, usb port or the usb socket uh, in replace with this one so i have here the usb that came from my old charger or the mobile charger so it has four port or four, four sound for this one then what i'm going to do is that i will solder this four into this one so the the data or well not the data but the orientation is that uh, in here we're going to solder the black the green the white and the red so here is the negative, here is the positive, then the green and white is for the data connection or for the data transfer. So we're now going to solder this one into this. So as you can see here, we're going to solder. Okay. So you finish the solder then it's supposed to work properly now So now, what we're going to do is that we already open our laptop, then we just insert this one into the USB port. So 
going to insert it is the USB port. So, 